multi drug resistant bacteria poses a challenge to modern medicine analyze how do we overcome this challenge or how can we overcome this challenge ha ah. so multi drug resistant bacteria is nothing but super bugs the same thing multi drug resistant bacteria is nothing but super bugs which talks about antimicrobial resistance which talks about antimicrobial resistance where bacteria which cause illnesses illness or diseases in humans become resistant to multiple treatment procedures and medication okay therefore the present treatment or medication that we have is no longer useful in treatment of patients for example you may write multi drug resistant tb mycobacterium which is posing grave challenge in treatment of tb patients then you can talk about what are the challenges to modern medicine what are the challenges to modern medicine so what are the challenges one you may talk about the treatment in hospitals are no longer beneficial in treatment of the patients correct so no longer beneficial or applicable in the treatment of patients what can you write increase in uh, healthcare expenditure correct increase in healthcare expenditure no that is how do we how do we overcome the challenges how do we deal with the challenge that is not the challenge to modern medicine what is the challenge to modern medicine then anything else we have to ha uh, we have to conduct more research and development because the present day medicines which are available with us are no longer useful or effective therefore we'll have to spend money resource as well as conduct more research and development in coming out with new medicines which may or may not be effective and this is going to be a time consuming process until which patients will suffer there are chances of increased infection rate the rate of infection may increase because people are not being treated okay uh, third thing is multi drug resistant bacteria uh, has become a, a big problem or challenge with respect to cross infection in hospitals okay so a person may go for the treatment of one particular disease due to cross infection the person who has gone for treatment of a simple uh, for a simple disease or illness may be infected with this multi drug resistant bacteria because of which he might once again fall ill or sick with a more severe or serious problem or illness okay what else it will affect ha huh, say human to animals uh, unlike hmm. then what else okay it can become a big burden on the nation poor countries for example who do not have tertiary healthcare sector especially in rural areas where you don't have tertiary healthcare so there will be more burden on hospitals okay so these uh, this you may write uh, research okay mild medicines don't work give stronger medicines ha ah, side effects of medicines for example uh, i still remember uh, with respect to uh, mdr tb itself there was a small girl it was there in the news many uh, some time back uh, this was a small girl and uh, Uh, severe case of tb okay so the parents wanted uh, treatment for tb but the hospitals were resistant because they did not want to give this newly developed treatment to that small girl because it may have adverse effects they did not go then they went to the court high court saying that illa kodle because they have no other option and that so it becomes a big problem it becomes a big problem we, we still do not know the efficacy because efficacy of medicine is based on long term study is based on long term study until then many people will suffer obviously poor people will not be able to afford new medicines okay so this is one thing so how can we deal with this challenge then most important thing we have to educate and sensitize people we have to educate and sensitize people 
about indiscriminate consumption of medicines we will have to regulate over the counter selling of medicines that is a big problem we have to regulate over the counter selling of medicines we must also involve doctors and hospitals when it comes to uh, making use of medicines okay so there has to be nuanced approach there should be nuanced approach where medicines must be used in limited cases only when it is absolutely necessary uh, we have to actually develop a policy and this policy see it is not going to affect any one person a village town city state or country it is going to affect the entire world so we have to develop a broad policy a global policy which is able to deal with multi drug resistant bacteria or super bugs okay so there is a necessity for developing a policy on how we are able to deal with it we will have to strengthen our healthcare infrastructure boost healthcare expenditure conduct more research and development identify these multi drug resistant bacteria as soon as possible isolate people who are infected with this uh by tracking and identifying patients with these multi drug resistant bacteria we should be able to at least control and mitigate at the same time we must develop a long term strategy in order to prevent such development of more and more multi drug resistant bacteria sorry antibiotic free meat free meat free meat ha 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 correct 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 so uh, regulate sorry this is a very important good point uh, we have also have to regulate and reduce the usage of antibiotics in poultry in poultry this is another big problem even if humans are not consuming we are pumping it into your meat products okay so this is also another problem so this way we will be able to deal with it clear ha huh. self medication before prescription of doctor so self medication have to be brought down so generic drug will be a big problem it won't be uh, generic so soon uh, strengthen policies and programs we can actually come out with a national program policy to deal with multi drug resistant microbes clear okay any doubts fine